morning. Joe here at Farms Friday. We're in the ammo dump shooting range at Larry's on North Memorial Parkway in beautiful downtown Huntsville. So today what I thought I'd do is give you a little look at the Smith & Wesson Bodyguard. Now, let me tell you about the Bodyguard. This thing's been around quite a while. Has uh, two six-round magazines it comes with. And I will have to tell you honestly that if I had a hundred of these, I'd probably put them out back, put lighter fluid on them and burn them because this is not a favorite gun of mine. Now, I know a lot of these guys that you see on video talk about, oh, these guns are great, but they're probably getting paid to do that. I'm not getting paid to do this. I'm just trying to share some facts with you. Uh, this gun is not a favorite gun of mine. I've never owned one, never wanted to own one, but uh, it's just too small. You know, I'm a pretty good sized guy. I'm like six, four, two and a quarter, and I've got these meat hooks for hands, and this is just too small for me to hold. Uh, another thing that's really interesting about this gun, the original version here, is this trigger, I'm gonna kind of get around here if we can pull this trigger. This trigger is about a 10 pound trigger. You can see how long before it finally breaks. So this is a, a real kind of a Smith & Wesson's effort to have a gun that you can put in your front pocket. Uh, again, not a fan ever, didn't ever want one. But wait, there's more, he said. Smith & Wesson has now come up with Bodyguard 2.0. And I love this little gun. Drastic improvements. Everything I didn't like about the Bodyguard Basic, they've improved on this one. This one comes with a 10 round magazine and a 12 round magazine, and the trigger is vastly improved. Let's look at the trigger here. You notice it has the little safety trigger in it, and watch this. Real nice crisp trigger right there. So this one is really nice, and it's got multiple ways you can grab it. The serrations here make it much easier to grab. Again, 380 ACP, uh, this thing is really nice. It's a really nice version. I really like it. It's really a great improvement over the Bodyguard 1.0, if you will, uh, the, what they just call the Bodyguard. But this gun is a really nice gun. It works really well. The trigger is fantastic on it. Uh, by having this 12 round magazine, it gives you enough for even a guy with big hands to get a grip on this thing. So this 12 round magazine makes a lot of difference. And in this smaller magazine, if you have smaller hands, uh, it works good for 10 rounds of 380 ACP. So I really like this gun, uh, Bodyguard 2.0 by Smith & Wesson. Uh, you know, Smith & Wesson has moved up to uh, Maryville, Tennessee for their headquarters and where they're manufacturing these. Uh, it's a really nice new facility they just opened last year up there. And they're doing some really great work up in Maryville. I like Maryville. I used to go up there every year for a couple of uh, weeks to visit. And it's a great place. And I'm really glad Smith & Wesson moved their headquarters and a lot of their production down here to Maryville, Tennessee. Because in Maryville, Tennessee, just like in Alabama, we love firearms. Unlike up in Massachusetts, not so much. All right. So that's it this week. This is the Bodyguard 2.0. Uh, come and check this out at Larry's, both locations. They're really nice guns. They shoot really well. They got great triggers. It's a great improvement over the original bodyguard. If you have an original bodyguard, you probably want to break it in and trade it in on one of these. Uh, these are such a vast improvement over the original bodyguard. I really like it. You ought to get one. All right, that's it for this week at Larry's. Come and shoot with us where we're open Tuesday through Friday, 10 till 6, Saturday 9 till 4. And remember, all of us here at Larry's want you to stay armed and stay safe. Bye-bye.